Hello, welcome. I was hoping to talk on a bit bigger stage, but it's enough when it's live streamed. Thank you everyone for coming. So I'm first time speaking at ETCC. It's my third time I came. So we'll speak about the subject Web3 is alive. So for a few years, we've been building Bonus. It's a huge ecosystem, which will eventually evolve to an everything operation system. It's powered on Ethereum. So few details about me. I'm an entrepreneur since the age of nine. I played Diablo 2 and sold digital items with 16. I moved to Dubai in 2007. My blockchain journey started with 16, uh, in 2016 with Bitcoin. Then I learned about blockchain after reading the white paper and fell in love with the technology. I co-founded the Dubai Blockchain Center and also I advised some projects which became very successful like Hi. I'm the chief strategic officer in a huge enterprise blockchain house before where we developed like stuff with Hyperledger Fabric where we tokenized GPS coordinates, really complex things. And at this time I saw Bot Ape Yacht Club and all these things and I was very surprised what's possible. So, in 21 I start building bonus and we need to start with the question, where are actually the real Web3 users? So, there are actually almost none because nobody built a proper consumer product yet. So the wallets, they don't really equal the users because in WhatsApp we have like 2 billion daily active users, 1.2 billion daily active users in uh, Insta and on Ethereum we don't even have 1 million daily active users. According to Dune's latest wallet anthology, most wallets in crypto sit idle while Ethereum has millions of wallets, only around 200 to 500,000 are active on chain each day using real applications. By comparison, Web2 applications serve billions of daily users. So Web3's challenge isn't more wallets, it's unlocking real and daily utility. So, meet bonus, the almost interoperable ecosystem for the real world. So bonus can do literally everything because the fundament is a wallet itself. So when I started my project, I figured out that we, no matter which idea I had, I need, like every normie user needs to use MetaMask or Trust Wallet or some of these wallets and anything what has a seed phrase or private key it's already too complicated. So I will show you guys a little trailer. It's just like 60 seconds, 40 seconds. Because we are about to scale heavy. So yes, so we're starting to do very nuclear onboarding soon with like maybe 5,000 of creators creating clips about how to use bonus, how to onboard and how to everything. So the technical stack, there's a lot, but I think this one, I don't know exactly, oh, I'm not in the presentation. Mode anymore. All right, so. So our ecosystem is for industries and creators who's literally, which allows literally every use case. We have a brand tool. So these brands, creators can onboard. Then they have an event manager tool, a loyalty 
program tool and NFT builder, no code, and a challenges quest builder. So we are like the galaxy of the real world. This slide I can easily talk for hours. So let's go to the next. So now I will show you guys the live demo. So let me try to link. All right, perfect. Okay, so this is our application. This is when you the first start. So it starts the profile. This is the hero page where you can aggregate all your social accounts on chain, your favorite links, your messaging apps, and everything what's public, what you can see on the right side with the eyes, that's what people see. If somebody scans you your QR code without the bonus application, then it's like kind of a link tree place, a link tree page. And here with this I can scan. So one of our super use cases to show it directly is quests and they can be any type of quest. So this is an Ethereum quest. So let's say I arrive to ETCC and I would have an activation with ETCC. So now we arrive and we check in and now we get the quests. So the first quest is like follow our account, take a picture on the brand wall down where all the sponsors, take a picture or story of an awesome speech or project, find this five foxes join a group picture at each CC and then also write a nice tweet for Vitalik Buterin, some reply. So basically we can gamify anything with this and the connector is not just limited to scan events and check in, we can also connect with humans. So this is Jessica, I scan now her QR code inside the bonus app and uh, yeah this is Jessica. Now I can also directly go to her Instagram, Facebook. I can also see her items, which are like dynamic NFTs. So we have vouchers, loyalty programs, memberships, subscriptions. We have unlimited use cases this way. And it's all functioning. So now, since I'm perhaps working in the shop, I can redeem Jessica's uh, voucher. And then she will click accept or reject. If she accepts, she burns it. We pay all the gas fees because we use account abstraction. We have a smart wallet system and um, we have also a explore page, a discovery. So we made it like a Netflix but instead of drama, movie, series, we have DeFi, buy with crypto, games and the, the dubs, they just start very easy. Like, I don't know any other wallet which can start any application like ours. I mean, look at this. I just click on Etina and now it will immediately connect me. Boom. And the same thing I can do with, I don't know, let's try maybe Avi. Connected. All right. So then basically. These are the dynamic NFTs, there are lots of them. And the wallet itself, it's also actually, that's the fundament, the baseline, how we started. So in the wallet, you have EVM and other ecosystems, so you can also switch to Bitcoin. You can buy without KYC up to $800, depending which country you choose. All regulated. Then you can swap very easy. I will show you guys a swap in a second. We have all the EVM chains. We have even much more, so, but we need to apply to grants from all of them so we can put them in. But literally, they are all very easy to put. We can sort them how we want. We can show them how we want because they are maxis. They only like some chains. We have the NFTs, ours we filter here. Uh, sending is very easy. So I just met Jessica before and I added her as my friend. So all I need to do is I write her name. I choose what she receives. So let's send her like a dollar. Review. Done. Very easy. My grandma is 90 years old. I managed to onboard her. So that's why it took three and a half years to build this. And now if I want to swap, for example, 
We also swap very easy. If we want another token, we enter the smart contract address. If we don't know, we click on coin market cap and paste it from there. Swap. Boom, done. Okay. All right. So what else can I show here? Mm. We have a game to onboard users where they collect the points because a lot of users, they will come from cheap traffic because in the real world, we can only onboard 100 users, 500 users, 1,000 users. But if we go hardcore with mini apps on Ton and others, we can onboard like 100,000 per day. But obviously, these users, they come to win something. So they can invite their friends and share it with everyone and so on. And then they redeem them and get free meme coins. And then they become Web3 users. So we convert Web2 users to Web3 users, basically. And since the app might be complicated for Web2 users, what we do is now it's a non-crypto app, but it's still fully on-chain. The wallet became a game. And if a user now wants to onboard or comes to an event with the camera roll and sees the event, So instead of him being forced to download our app, he can just create an account on the web. Very easy. We use Web3 out, which just was bought by Consensus. We've been using it since it was Toros, since day one. But a lot of things changed. All right, so I will quickly finalize the pages here. And then maybe we can have some questions. So yeah, I was showing you guys all of this. So our next steps and achievements which are required, we'll release our SDK so every Web2 app can basically get Web3 features easy by logging us in while they are logged in. So it's like this babushka system. Then we like to have a 16 zero paradigm as lead VC, and then also we would like to have Vitalik Buterin as our advisor. Last year Vitalik told me that we built the most complete uh, Web3 product he ever seen. Oh, and I forgot to show the lens feed which we integrated, and we, we, we aggregate so many things, even government IDs and KYC tokens for RWA. Then hopefully we will migrate from base to mega -eat because everything runs on base. Not b it's, it's cheap and fast and works, but personally, we have zero support from any network in the ETH ecosystem. So yes, my friends, uh, thank you so much for listening. I will answer some questions. This is the Ethereum quest. Whoever wants to participate, I recommend just take a picture from this page and you can scan it later from the picture. Also the people who watch on the internet because I'm going to scale you to 100,000. And uh, thank you. If somebody has a question, please ask. Uh, I think it's a really interesting product, mainly because you're talking about um, abstracting away the, the, the pass phrase, the seed phrase. But so I d what I don't understand is if I, I'm a user, I'm starting to use it, where is the seed phrase? Uh, the seed phrase. There's no seed phrase. There's only a private key. We use Web3 out and we use um, MPC, multi-party competition, with a multi-factor authentication. So the user just logs in with the email and password. So like the face ID links to, a, a pri a, was it on a server, the, the private key for the wallet? Yeah, you don't. We, we don't want the user to have the private key. Yes, but no, if they that. want it, they can extract it. They log in in Web3 out and they extract okay. it. Okay, all oh, right, that's great. No. So we create from the same Web3 out EOA, which comes the smart account wallet, the 4337. We have the Bitcoin wallet and the Solana. And there will be more, but they need to really give us grants. Otherwise, you know, I, I, I didn't accept much investment because I just want the right partners in it. I'm not about money. This is a mission. Yeah, I think it looks good. And also, I think you're, you're thinking about the incentives. I think where a lot of these new apps can get it wrong is like incentives to actually use the product. 
you know. Yeah. That's the product is life. I mean, the fastest onboarding in the world. It takes like a minute, literally, and you have a self-custodial wallet. Today we just updated a new version. There's 50 languages coming. There's so much coming, but we just need the right people. Okay, thanks. Thanks. Maybe some complicated technical question. All right, thank you. And if you like to collect this NFT, you, I'll give it out to you. My pleasure. Thank you so much. And I hope next year you guys see me on the big stage. <laughs>